it's great to have you here today. Could okay. you please briefly introduce yourself to the viewers, please? Okay. So my name is Rodrigo Mendes. Mm -hmm. I'm CEO from NR Securities, uh, an investment, uh, fully re regulated investment exchange in El Salvador. Oh, uh, you're from El Salvador? El wow. Salvador. <laughs> <laughs> and, well, our company just offer to the worldwide uh, investors uh, advice, consulting structure mm -hmm. for real world assets uh, in crypto. And not only that, we also provide uh, all the distribution channel. Mm -hmm. We have a trading platform, oh, we have cool. uh, all the trading channels, we have institutional investors, we have institutional channels and everything. So we are more just than a uh, leading platform mm -hmm. for uh, real world assets in, in Occident. So we are a uh, gateway for digital assets. Cool, in, in excellent. In the, in the I know that El Salvador is one of the most friendly with cryptocurrency in the world. Then what do you think about the STO market these days? Well, what are your thoughts on them? Well, when I invested over there, when we, we I'm original from Brazil, I, I'm citizen oh, from Brazil. You're from Brazil. Yeah, <laughs> I'm from Brazil. But uh, when they invited us to invest in, oh. in El Salvador, yeah. it was just at the beginning when they were launching the Bitcoin law. Mm -hmm. And I understood the, es the essence, the, 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 the ideology, everything behind the technology, the, the, the crypto and everything. Mm -hmm. And then I said, so it's going to work because oh. uh, uh, here there's not only uh, political propaganda, mm -hmm. nothing like that. Yeah. It's just they like this, they, they love need it. this. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's actually a Bitcoin yeah. country. Yeah, it is. It's a uh, maximalist reduce. Mm. So, and for digital assets, mm -hmm. so they decided to build that frame, the regulatory, the regulatory framework from the top of the technology. Yeah. And so now we have the best regulatory framework for mm. distribute uh, assets from mm. from all over the world. Right yeah. now, we are receiving Swiss assets, oh. real world assets, yeah. like on the finance, like back at five. Mm -hmm. So they are uh, being distributed by us because yeah. we have the proper regulatory framework for that. Mm -hmm. Cool. Then, how do you see the current global regulatory landscape for STOs, and what challenges do you anticipate? Oh, this is something very <laughs> clever to ask because uh, as we act worldwide yeah. so, uh, and we monitor all mm -hmm. the countries and we have licenses and yeah. ongoing in other countries, mm -hmm. uh, actually we are in the point of inflection because uh, each governor or each jurisdiction has their own understanding of yeah. what, how to to, to regulate the capital markets yeah. and and but they are in the phase that is still denying the cross border mm. issue that not issue but advantage of yeah. the technology and this is something that we gonna we're gonna see a, a very strong challenge between countries and mm -hmm. and, and and the players like yeah. us so we still pushing mm -hmm. them but they're going to still <laughs> yeah then what do you think about the korean STO markets especially i think it's 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 is is starting to work uh, 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 as a, a, a starting to position uh, as, mm -hmm. as as someone that wants to make this bigger yeah and and, and to be a place in the mm -hmm. uh, a, a, a trade finance place in the world like yeah. el salvador yeah. is the same has mm. the same vision so over there we have the same vision to be the the singapore of late in america because the country is well is small and we need that to to, to work so and probably this is going to be the success here mm -hmm. because uh it's, it's going to be the same I, yeah. I, idea you know the same drive mm. to so we need to perform the best regulatory framework from the world to the world yeah not not from here mm. only to here. Because in Korea at current stage, we still have quite strict regulations with STOs or even cryptocurrency. Mm -hmm. But do you still find the Korea market is attractive? 
I think by himself, mm -hmm. when we talk about crypto and we're talking about everything, so yeah. we need to understand that we shift the market. Okay. So we're talking worldwide players, mm -hmm. so right now. Mm -hmm. uh, and the local players, the regional players inside mm -hmm. each country, they yeah. have to decide, the banks, mm -hmm. the, the, sure. the stock exchange, yeah. they're gonna need to shift their position to mm -hmm. a, a global position mm -hmm. right now. So this is something that we we see and this is something that what is happening yeah maybe right we now. need more time for it right yeah okay then can you provide an example of a successful sto that your company has facilitated so we launched a public offering mm -hmm. uh of it's called esoy for a company De called egrains it's oh. a, it's a token uh fully backed by soy soybeans oh okay Futures, soybean. soybean future contracts That's yeah so <laughs> commodities so it was the first uh, yeah. commodities wow. uh, issues mm -hmm. uh, in token uh, and was completely success so we we were we were in all pays in Forbes everything and oh. was distributed very fast cool then in your opinion what does the future hold for the STO market in the next five to ten years in the future do you think it's still growing or well actually we're gonna we're gonna pass through the investors institutional investors adoption mm -hmm. so until they realize how can they uh, build the governance oh. required yeah. and the mandates to mm. onboard the money inside those yeah. new instruments mm -hmm. so this is something very 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 important uh, the second is, of course, uh, the the jurisdictions, you know, alignment yeah. between what is considered STO in mm. one jurisdiction, what is considered STO in others, yeah. in other, and how will be the promotion uh, 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 side as we are now in are in the web are in internet mm. and influencers yeah. are distributing whatever mm. so this is something that those five ten years will be aligned and okay. of course this has the main consequence mm -hmm. the liquidity to the market and make the market strong cool. and here comes the last question for you um, is there any advice you'd give to companies or investors who are considering participating in an STO? Sure, uh, definitely uh, is not a there's not a a, 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 a ready recipe mm. but we have already companies that are in the field yeah. for for years yeah that is all so uh, look for a partner like yeah. Inor that we're in the field like mm. since 2012 yeah. Inor started their operations formally three years ago since it started mm. with the license fully permissioned yeah. so being with uh, this kind of partners uh, it makes you not make mistakes mm, true. issuing tokens yeah. issuing your assets mm. things like that or if it is a player that wants to be inside like institutional like banks like yeah. assets like man wealth managers mm. asset managers also to be partner of what's going on yeah. in the future mm. with some important some important players in the crypto space because we know the technology and yeah. and, and one more thing mm. we are 12 years distributing mm -hmm. for a new generation oh. that has access mm -hmm. to new type of investments mm -hmm. so it's a completely different, different distribution yeah. that we see inside mm -hmm. traditional stock exchange sure. so, so uh, this always is seek help from the experience yeah so this 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 this, this exchange yeah. of 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 experience between the traditional finance and 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 the decentralized finance it's 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 something that might be considered mm -hmm. and and between someone that really wants to get uh in the uh, inside this market mm -hmm.
Okay, and you're always here to help them, right? Yeah, I'm <laughs> If trying someone asks you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, thank you so much for your time for the interview today. Oh, it's my pleasure. Thank you.